The ASC is short for Aiman Solar Concentrator, which is the fifth generation of solar concentrators that has unique features overcoming the problems in previous solar concentrators. It's an innovative metallic lens that concentrates solar radiation by thousands of times to a fixed focal point on the ground, resulting in very high temperature heat that can be easily accessed and transferred without the need for flexible joints, eliminating all problems associated with it. It tracks the sun in two-dimensional motion from sunrise to sunset, harvesting solar energy in the most efficient way with a theoretical optical efficiency of 100%. The high temperature solar heat can be stored via low-cost thermal energy storage or TES technologies like molten salt, backed bed with ceramic or rocks, thermal oil, and others. This TES can be used to generate electricity overnight by generating steam to power steam turbines or powering a combine cycle plant. This high temperature heat can also be used to generate green hydrogen via known thermolysis technologies or via electrolysis. The ASC can be used for off-grid applications as a microgrid and can be coupled with PV systems to generate electricity day and night. A commercial scale 10 meter diameter system has been built at Mazdar Solar Institute platform since 2019 and has been tested and verified by third parties, including the German TUV Institute. The ASC is optimized for commercial production and is ready to be scaled up for projects in solar electricity production with storage, green hydrogen production, water desalination, solar industrial heat applications, and others. The ASC technology has been reviewed by many international research institutes, and peer-reviewed publications of this patented technology have been published in highly respected international journals. A commercial-scale prototype has been constructed and tested at Mazdar Institute Solar Platform in Abu Dhabi in the United Arab Emirates. To demonstrate the temperature at the focal area, sheets of various metals were placed at the focal area. The solar tracking system aims the concentrator in the direction of the sun to concentrate the solar radiation onto the sheet. Aluminum sheets were placed at the focal point with variable thickness up to 5 millimeters. As the concentrator is tracking the sun, the aluminum starts to melt within 40 seconds. After 90 seconds, a 25 centimeter hole has been melted in the aluminum sheet, corresponding to the designed focal area. Aluminum melts at around 700 degrees Celsius. The melting of aluminum sheets was verified and certified by the German TUV. The experiment is repeated with a 2 millimeter brass sheet this time. Brass melts at around 1000 degrees Celsius. The melting of brass test was also verified by the TUV. To test and verify the performance of the ASC to harvest and store thermal energy, a special spherical receiver is designed and constructed with an experimental setup to measure the thermal power obtained from the ASC. As the sun rises, the ASC concentrates solar radiation on the spherical receiver through which thermal oil flows and was heated to temperatures up to 400 degrees Celsius. During daytime, the ASC continues to track the sun and keeps on heating the thermal oil while storing it in thermal storage tanks where heat can be extracted after sunset. This is a time-lapse video covering an entire day. After sunset or overnight, steam can be generated by extracting the heat from the thermal oil. This steam can be used to generate electricity or for any other applications or industrial process. The German TUV have certified the results and the data of the all-day thermal performance of the ASC. It came to the conclusion that the ASC is an efficient solar thermal device with thermal storage. The total solar to thermal efficiency of the system reached 95% and with improvements, it's expected to climb to 97%. Although some other solar concentrators, like the Heliostat solar towers, are known to kill birds as they concentrate solar radiation upwards for hundreds of meters, crossing the natural flying paths of birds, the ASC has a 25 centimeter diameter focal area, which is only two meters below its concentrator. As can be seen, 
a bird enjoys the shade of the ASC, while the temperature at the focal area exceeds 1,000 degrees Celsius. Birds fly around the concentrator safely and can land on its reflectors without being harmed. In fact, over the last four years of operation, no single incident of harming any bird or wildlife has been registered. An optimized commercial design is made for the 10 meters in diameter ASC-10 and for the 15 meter in diameter ASC-15. The optimized ASC-10 model is much lighter than the pilot model built in master with 75% reduction in weight and is designed to be very cost effective. The optimized model is designed to be assembled in IKEA-like fashion with minimum labor and tools needed at site. It can withstand winds up to 160 kilometers per hour and the receiver is shielded by an innovative hood to reduce waste heat through convection and radiation. A cluster of six units is designed and simulated for shadowing that take up an area of only 2,000 square meters to produce around one megawatt thermal during daytime or half a megawatt for 12 hours of operation overnight. The area needed for ASC is about one-third of the area needed for any other solar system to produce the same energy. A full power plant using the ASC would look like this. The ASC does not require totally flat land to install a plant. Only the area under each ASC needs to be flat, but each one of them can be placed at a totally different elevation with a land gradient of more than 10%.